what's up guys? Uh, headed to Lake Cumberland. I'm actually on the Louis B. Nunn Cumberland Parkway. It's like a straight shot across southern Kentucky all the way. It runs from just north of Bowling Green to Somerset, which it runs pretty much from the eastern edge of western Kentucky all the way over to the western edge of eastern Kentucky and it's just it's straight big a lot of straight and hills and starting to come into more of crossing into western or eastern Kentucky with more hills but like it says the Cumberland Parkway which means Lake Cumberland Headed to my uncle's cabin, which is actually over on the river, on the east side of the lake. So, I'm gonna hit up Cumberland Falls, which you definitely should if you ever come to Lake Cumberland. And uh, probably some, do some other things. Definitely gonna either tomorrow or Friday on the way home. Gonna hit up Lake Cumberland for some small mountain. Spotted bass because I'll probably have a better chance of spotted bass than smallmouth right now with this weather, but because it's 82. And uh, you, you guys will kind of get to hang out for the ride. And I'll, uh, you guys are going to be there a lot quicker than I am, so just hang on. Well, checking back in. Uh, we are in Burnside, Kentucky, which is on the Cumberland River, the east side of the Cumberland River, or the east end. Uh, had a pretty interesting event. There's Riley sticking her head in right there. Can you say hi? Uh, definitely got ran off the road by a semi. Kind of wasn't recording. <laughs> Should have been. Uh, but yeah, I was riding the right lane. We were just cruising. We're not in a hurry. It's vacation cruising down the right hand lane and he's passing me on the left and next thing I know bam he's just he's coming over and luckily there's pretty good emergency lane and I just let off the gas and moved over and laid on my horn and there's tricked out Peterbilt behind him and he's flashing his lights and on his big train horn or whatever it was he had and they all passed and Chelsea ended up getting over moving over and they all went by and she tucked back in in front of me. I was, I was pissed. Oh, I was mad. I was, said some unchristian words and uh, told him he was number one. But, uh, yeah, we're almost there. Uh, over in eastern Kentucky, over in the hills. Uh, it's gorgeous out here. Uh, the river is like right over there. You can't really see it because of the trees in the winter you can usually see it pretty good but uh should be at the cabin here soon we'll check back in give you a tour well here's a little tour the kitchen a little dining room the girls are eating lunch the living room damn we're cool oh, that's a close one. upstairs Come in here, you got laundry room. Here's the master TV. Bam, look at this. Bathroom. Little area there. And you got downstairs. Like storage room, big bathroom, another little kitchen. This is like two completely different little setups here. Another bathroom, and what could be another master right out there. Bam! 
people don't come here very often. He lives in Florida and cabins up here in Kentucky. So it's uh, sometimes stuff's overgrown. But let's head back up here. Deck. Look at that view. And upstairs. Cabin's not quite finished. He's still been working on it. Oh. Uh, come up here. Oh, you got another bedroom with an amazing view. Kind of a drop, but hey, look at these ceilings. It's gorgeous. Another bathroom. I need to show where the bed stays. And bedroom for the kids, which they think is cool because it's got like hospital beds. Closet. That's the air handler for up here. A little balcony. Pretty cool. So, pretty nice. Oh. Got to finish bringing stuff in on the car. Everybody else, well, Chelsea and Bailey ran to get dinner stuff from the grocery store. But other than that, just settling in, hanging out for the day. Uh, it's looking like weather is about to blow in, so we'll see. Uh, catch you guys later. It's the end of the day. It's we changed time zones. So we're over in Eastern, so it's like 9:30. Uh, kids are going to bed. We're just hanging out. Fire's dying down, and I'm going fishing in the morning. So taking you guys along. Let me know what you think of this video. If it's boring or whatever, it is kind of kind of a travel vlog, but. Uh, I mean, look at this. Out in the middle of nowhere. But uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. And I'm hoping when we do another trip like this, probably in August, I'm going to have a chesty. Or like a GoPro on a chest rig. So a little more interactive. But catch you guys later. See ya.